Hey buddy, you wrote the strong man's back. How are you feeling? Feeling strong. Yeah? Feeling strong, but feeling tired. Pre-workout's not kicked in yet. Any particular goals that you've got, mate? The main one would be kind of building strength on the shoulders. That seems to be the one that's lagging behind a wee bit. All hands on deck doing that, you know. Looking smoother this week, eh? Just focusing on getting that, that pop. Feeling good, kind of dropping the weight back. Really focusing on everything. Just to build it up again, you know? You've been used to training with yourself for, for quite a bit throughout the year. How much do you think it's changed or impacted your training, having them back, and has it increased your motivation at all? Training by yourself is good to a, a certain, certain extent, but you obviously want to kind of surround yourself with people that are better than you, mm. or close to it, in my case, they're, they're a lot better than me. <laughs> um, you miss some things when you're training by yourself. You don't see some cues that you could change or some slight variations in, in how you lift. Our schedules are all different. You do have to train by yourself. And for everyone training, I think it is good to, to try that. Don't rely on other people, you know, to, to get that motivation. You have, yeah. to, you have to kind of find that from, from yourself. And I've definitely found that but now it's the next stage for like competing. That whole next step in my, my journey, I think uh, training with Luke and Tom is, is what I have to do. As you get closer to competing mm. or, or getting in that form of competing, what's the mentality like? Is there any extra nervousness, extra anxiousness in your head? There's always a wee bit of like nervousness. I think that's good, and especially for, for myself. My situation is a bit different than, than other people, you know, with like Luke and Tom being, being where they are. But I don't let it kind of consume me or see it as a problem. I'm just focusing on training, getting stronger, getting all the lifts, all the technique side of things down. That's all really I have to focus on and that kind of takes up like 80% of my mental capacity because there's so much, it does, so much to, to learn, it doesn't mm -hmm. happen overnight, you know. Find it easier on the pushing out there. Do I feel comfortable enough to do that? <laughs> Easy. Yeah. Just, uh, just tried something new, just one motion in it. It's not the first time you've one motion one time. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> Felt good. When you do learn stuff from Tom and Luke, do you feel like it's it's easier than learning it from like a, a coach, for example, since they're, they're they're your brothers? When they say some harsh things or some stuff mm. like that you don't tend to take it to heart because you know they want the best for you do you think that that's a bit easier i think it definitely helps yeah and it's good taking kind of any kind of criticism from them is because they've they've done they've been there done that like they've made all their mistakes you know they've been in the, the strongman world for years coaches coaches are all good and they're they're brilliant but luke and tom have been in competitions they know how to to think before competitions during and after and they're my big brothers so they they're always kind of looking out for my best interest so I think that's a really positive thing you know to think of
What are you saying? Right, come on, man. Just the same, same uh, weights as last week and reps. Hey. What do you say, bro? Do a heavy on the way. <laughs> yeah, he's got me doing five threes. See if people want to do reps and like do five sets of three. Just change it to twos because it's easier work. How do I feel, my dude? Uh, not very good, but... Still got it. Just lost her balance at the end, was it? Yeah. Still getting into it. Head's not in it yet. Need to get in the zone. You're like struggling, you're like ah. And then if you just... You know, if, you're, if you're there, and then push your head through. Yeah. I feel a lot better. You want, you want that to go through. Yeah. You want it to go. Yeah, because then you know what? Like, as soon as you got down. But if you were here and then looked, it would have been another second or so before you put it down. You know when a judge. Just try to go. Yeah, but yeah. then you, that's what you, you need. You want to look here, he's down here, but you, he's sitting down, you're still at that, and then taking it down, you know? So they don't usually use their voice, they use their hand as well. So. Um, are you wanting this again? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You say that felt a lot better that second time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just uh, different little cues I need to learn. Yeah, um, it's uh, especially when you're getting up in the weight, you need to get everything right, and that kind of head head through, as opposed to leaning back. It's just it's all uh, it's all tiny little changes that I'm making. So long. <laughs> <laughs> One heart. They're doing dumbbell, but I've got to shoot off pretty soon, so I'm just kind of cutting the, the workout short, you know. Doing some uh, farmer's walks. What's the weight? Uh, 110, I think, yeah. yeah. Back and four. With a turn? Yeah, I think I'll just I'll do a drop. Okay. <laughs> Maybe a turn on the last one.
around here. Sorry, right there. Three, seven. Ooh, jeez. The guys are strong, but of course he's fucking strong. He's a fucking stole man. too wide that's when things start to yeah. go like that as well so if it's smaller steps or faster yeah, yeah. that's a bit better are you excited to have the series of road to strongman come back uh yeah yeah like it's good to kind of show everyone everyone that journey i particularly don't like being in front of the camera um but needs must um it's uh It'll be good to look back on, you know, um, and give anyone who's starting out a kind of insight to what it takes and and maybe help them. That's something that's that's really cool, you know. And yeah, let's let's see where the the series kind of kind of goes.